we have here a ATV all terrain vehicle Yamaha Grizzly 350 4x4 and we have problem with the cylinder head gasket that is leaking oil see from this place where the chain for camshaft is running it's throwing oil I have watched the engine but it's coming a lot here so we have to replace this gasket also this gasket when we split so this is the project we start with removing all the guards fuel tank seat there is a lot of bolts and screws so we start with seat fuel tank and the guards remember to disconnect the battery before repairing so we have dis dismounted all the guards fenders and it looks like this all the stuff guard fenders trailers fuel tank seat now we will dismount muffler exit pipe air duct maybe not this air duct but this one for sure this air duct air filter carburetor and reverser forward reverse now we have removed parts next step is to remove uh, recoil starter cover for timing chain and the sprocket for the camshaft and tensioner also this uh, head holder and then we have a look on the timing before we take uh, down the head we have to see how the timing chain was set so there is a plastic cap you have to remove and there is a mark on the cover here and then there is oh, see there is a mark on the flywheel hope you can see it there's, there's, there's a mark there I hope you can see it now you can see both and then there is a mark on the cover here and this mark on the sprocket here so you see they don't match here they don't match we have to take the chain uh, I mean sprocket for the chain one to the left so now we take uh, dismount the, the sprocket for the chain and then we have to secure the chain with some wire so it will not fall down to the chamber and then we take the tappet covers here and uh, this holder and those four main bolts here and we have two more here so now we go we have head removed
that was the problem here so the gasket is gone so the oil was coming out here over here so we have to replace new gasket but we have another problem with the piston a lot of scratches here it looks that those lubricating holes they were not giving enough oil oh I don't know what the same in the cylinder see the scratches The top is in very good condition, no damage, valve is good, we need new gasket here, but I don't know what about this piston, I have to make decision, but this is the disassembly steps. We will meet in next video when we assemble.